Right, guys, before I start this shit fest, I didn't say it in the video because I was too busy ranting about it, but I'm making this a challenge video. The challenge is just to get to the end of the fucking level. If you could do that, you're my hero. Because, yeah, watch the video and you'll see what the problem is. <laughs> okay, um, yeah. Yeah, it's... Yeah. If you thought uh, Shadow of the Beast 2 was hard, play this. This is the Super Nintendo version of the Terminator. So make sure you've got that. Not the Mega Drive, not the Mega CD, not any other version. The Super Nintendo. Now, I didn't even know this existed. And for very, very good reason. It's shit. So, have a go. Alright guys, I have to show you this. If I didn't record this, you wouldn't even believe me that it exists. A, a Super Nintendo version of the Terminator. So that means the Mega Drive's got a game, Mega CD's got a game, and the Super Nintendo's got a game. And all three of them are completely different games. But the, the look of this is just... Ah, uh, well... This isn't going to be long. This isn't going to be a long video, I'll tell you that now. I had a quick go. I mean, what's this music? Listen to it. What the fuck is that supposed to be? Doesn't sound like anything, does it? And the, the character you played looks like he's from Contra. 1993. So this is well after the, uh, the Mega Drive one, wasn't it? And it just starts. Look. There's no, there's no st uh, star or anything. Look at this character. What the fuck is he wearing? He's wearing blood. He actually looks worse than the Mega Drive guy. When you shoot, he shoots uh, diagonal. So you can't even shoot up. Suck it, bitch. That's as far as I've got. Never got any further than that. And I'll start way at the beginning again. This, um, yeah. People keep going about these stairs being more powerful and having better ports. This is garbage. And a lot of the Disney uh, platform games were garbage on the snares as well. And Robocop vs Terminator was garbage on the snares, so I'm wondering where the hell was all this snares power? This seems to just be with their exclusives. Yep, dead again. I don't know where the lives are or anything. I take it it's the hearts which are my lives and the red squares are my health. I'm going to say this right now. This game's a piece of shit. It doesn't control very well. The graphics are rubbish. The music's rubbish. The sound effects are rubbish. Yeah. What the 
fucking game where you can't shoot up. Fuck's sake, I'm dead again. This is all you're going to see in the game, guys. I said it was going to be a short one. Oh, for f this game is just bullshit. And this is the Terminator again. I thought the Mega Drive one was bad enough. I'll probably play that at some point as well. And the Mix CD one. That one's actually fun to play. They don't even look like Terminators. They're sort of retarded. Oh no. Oh no, game over. Jesus, can you imagine if you paid for that full price on the snares? I don't know if there's a rolling demo on the, the beginning of the game or not, but that was fucking awful. Get rid of that. Mindscape, I mean, who the hell are these people? Have you ever heard of them? Because I haven't. Like I said, I didn't even know this version even existed. There was good reason, it seems. I, uh, I really can't recommend this version of the game. I'm going to have to watch a YouTube video of someone else playing it. It can't just be me that uh, thinks it's crap. Mindscape, I've never heard of them. And who made the Mega Drive one? Probe, wasn't it? Probe made a shitload of games. They made Alien 3 as well, didn't they? But Mindscape, who the hell are these people? It works cheapness because you press start, just put you straight in the game. There's no menu. That's the same screen I saw before. What's it going to show me? Anything there? No! There's not even a rolling demo. You know what? Fuck this game, guys. <laughs> oh, if you thought that was bad, let me know. Well, I'll catch you in the next video. Bye, guys.